This example is like problem 11 in the exam review. Uh, we have a sales manager who believes that mean company sales per month uh, are more than 10 million. So we make a test. Uh, null hypothesis is that the mean is 10. Uh, alternative is the mean is greater than 10. The null hypothesis is rejected. Um, so that means we're going to conclude the alternative hypothesis is true. They want us to state a conclusion. So where well, your conclusion always refers to the alternative hypothesis. So we would say that there is enough evidence to conclude that mean sales are greater than 10 because that is what the alternative is, greater than 10. Uh, if we did not reject, we would say there is not enough evidence to conclude the mean sales are greater than 10. So the second part stays the same. It's just if you reject, there is enough evidence. If you don't reject, there is not enough evidence.